Hey there. So I've been curious as far as cleaning the bill plate, what products, what other products work and might not work. I always hear alcohol, soap and water, I never hear vinegar. I myself always use 99% alcohol, always have, haven't had an issue, but just got curious to see if anything else works. On my previous test, I did it on a texture plate. As many of you know, texture plate do stick very well and they all worked. All four products worked. So this time I decided to be a little more challenging. So this is going to be on a smooth 3D effect build plate from Bamboo. This is the Starry. does have the option of the diamonds but this one actually sticks very well so i decided to do an actual challenge and see on this one because this one i've had a few failures where they don't stick so just check it out so today i will be testing regular tap water fresh fresh from the faucet 70 percent alcohol 99 percent, which is what i always use and white vinegar five percent the vinegar I've heard a few people it doesn't seem to be mentioned often when it comes to water I always hear soap and water but I'm just gonna tap test regular tap water to see if I notice anything different first test is gonna be between these two 70% alcohol and 99% alcohol I don't think I'm gonna have an issue with the alcohol I might have an issue with either water or vinegar but we'll see what happens. Okay, first I'll be using 70% on the left side. Get this out of the way. 99% on the right side. As you can see, the 99% the alcohol is drying very, very fast. And the uh, 70%, you still see a few drops few wet areas but it's drying up We're about to get started with the first layer my concerns are if there's any issues it would be adhesion and black PLA I'm curious to see if I do get those different colored marks on the first on the bottom of it <clears throat> we'll see once that's done pretty much set I am also using the standard profile for the 0.2 millimeter Nothing different. The uh, only thing is I changed it from 15% infill to 5% because it's just a test print. I wanted to show So the basic profile, heat settings, 220 for the nozzle, 65 for the bed. Pretty much the same settings <clears throat> as with the textured plate. The A1 doesn't seem to change the settings for it. I know the P1 does. So first layer is done, everything's stuck, I see no real issues, a few strands here and there, might have needed to dry my filament a little longer but otherwise everything looks good, sticking, 
I'll come back when it's done. This was 70%, 99%, so I'm mark it. Alrighty, so, so far, running well. I didn't think there would be much of an issue, and there isn't. Okay, start taking these off. 99 and 70%. You see the glitter on both sides, I see no difference. A little bit of an issue here, but I think that's the filament. I hadn't dried it in a while. But it looks good. You can actually see the texture, the 3D print texture. Okay, no issues, printed well. Both are coming off just as easy, not doing extra force on either one. You move them, you can't tell the difference. So between 70 and 90%, there's no difference. At least not that I can see. Both sides held very well. Looks good, I see no extra lines, no markings. So no issues between both of them. 70, 90%, print it well. Now I'm going to go ahead and test tap water, just basic faucet, not even purified water, versus distilled vinegar or white vinegar. First, just some regular tap water. That'll be on the left side. I'm going to get it too much because this will take a while to dry. Now I have white vinegar, that'll go on the right side. The minutes you know, mixing vinegar with other products can be dangerous. You know, you don't mix vinegar with Clorox. I think you're also not supposed to mix vinegar with alcohol so just know that be careful when you're cleaning I've had that happen where I mix Clorox and vinegar and ooh, that is strong so okay and let that dry a little again vinegar tap water again the important layer to me I feel with this test is first layer as long as that first layer goes down well, I don't think I'll have an issue. We'll see. can honestly say I am surprised I didn't get any issues so far from tap water or the white vinegar. Mostly tap water. I thought it was going to be, be some issue. But first layer is down. Everything's sticking so far. We'll be back when it's done. We'll see what happens. So this was tap water, white vinegar. Just going to mark them. Okay, so here's the tap water, my vinegar side. Again, I'm surprised how well this one's stuck. Let's see if there's any residue. My vinegar, 
tap water. I don't see anything. You can see the 3D print. Same thing, I see no difference. Check this one too. So besides that, little bubbles. Not much of a difference. Let's see this one. So this one, I do see a little, some streaking. I'm not sure the camera can see it. Here you can see. Okay, so yeah, to me, if I feel like, like on your shower door, sometimes you get water, water spots. That's what I'm seeing on it. And actually, I could actually see it on the plate too. Right here. But I do see some watermarks on the plate, and they did transfer over to the prints a little. You can see them there. At least I can see them. <clears throat> so, my conclusion for this is, as far as adhesion, they all work so far. Will I switch over to using vinegar? No, I don't think I will. I'm not sure what damage, if any, it might do to the plates. As far as tap water, I see no reason. I will continue with 99% alcohol or even do 70%. Either way, both of those came out really well. I do have those here, the ones that I printed with alcohol. And besides my fingerprint there, I did not see any marks at all. These look very clear. Let's see if you can see it. So this one is 70% alcohol, and this one here is white vinegar. There, I don't know if you can see the little watermarks, dried watermarks in there. So yeah, so it seems like it doesn't dry enough where it leaves some residue on it, but alcohol doesn't. I will continue using alcohol to clean my plates. I don't see the purpose of using a washing your plate every single time with water and soap. I've been printing for a while. I've never had an issue. Hope this helps someone. Thank you.